Hey guys! Sorry that <laughs> I didn't do a video yesterday. Sorry that it's in this format. I'll explain a little bit of that later. But I did want to recap tonight's game between the Yankees and the Orioles. A good win for the Yankees here, especially after yesterday in which, while it was a bad loss for the Yankees, um, losing, what, 8-1 to Tampa Bay, it was fine because we at least won two out of three. This one, though, for a good portion of the game, it looked like, oh boy, the Yankees, you know, they were not going to be able to come through here uh, and lose to Baltimore, especially after that terrible fifth inning that Kluber had. And Kluber honestly pitched fine, except for that fifth inning and then the home run that he gave up in the first. Uh, that is what I've noticed a lot about these Yankee starters, is that they'll have, like, a pretty good outing except for one bad inning. I feel like I've seen that in almost, except for Cole, everyone else, they have solid starts with a terrible outing. Um, and that is what's making it so hard for this Yankee rotation to officially become elite. I feel like is not being... It's getting better, but you still have, like, those one or two innings where everything will just fall apart. Um, I feel like if that eventually goes away, then I feel like the Yankees will have an elite rotation. But for now, Kluber, again, was fine. He's been better. Six innings, seven hits, four runs, two walks, six strikeouts. Um, but the, yeah, that, that fifth inning was costly there. Um, and the Yankees' offense really didn't do a lot today, but they did enough. Um, Judge, I'm so glad that drought is over. <laughs> the two home runs in the first inning and then in the fourth inning, um, the, the first two runs of the game there, for the Yankees. It was great seeing him get um, give, give the Yankees that offensive support. And then outside of that, DJ had the two hits. Uh, Frazier had the hit. I mean, I know the offense took a little bit of a hit with Torres being out. Um, it was nice seeing Andujar get his first hit of the season. Um, there wasn't really a lot in this game for the Yankees until the seventh. Andujar and Higashio could get on base. And then Gio Urshela off the bench. A fantastic home run to center field to make it a 5-4 game, giving the Yankees the win. Uh, from there on, and then the bullpen does what the bullpen does, which is elite. Um, that is what I've noticed a lot about this Yankee team is they won't score a lot. They'll have those games where their offense disappears for a, a good portion of it, but they do enough. In the big spots, in, in games like this, they do enough. And it might come back to haunt us in the postseason. But for now, here in the regular season, as we sit here on, what, May 14th, I'm good with it. Right now, I'm, I just get the wins. Just get those wins. Get those necessary wins. Uh, to, to keep improving your standing. And um, so I, I was happy with that today. Again, I would like to see a little bit more from the offense, more from guys not just named uh, Judge and Urshela, but they did enough in this game to get that win and just take advantage of the bad teams. You're taking on Baltimore, which is not a great team. Take advantage of it and, and keep it moving here uh, going forward. Here. So very happy with the Yankees here in this game. Oh, and Tyler Wade, leave. DFA Tyler Wade. Right, this guy is doing nothing. I don't care how fast he is. He is a, he is a complete liability on this team. Um, he brings nothing. So, yeah, th that's, that's really my thought on that game. I mean, people complain about Gardner, and Tyler Wade is even more useless there. So, um, a fine job by the Yankees here, getting the win. Very impressive. Now, um, I didn't do a video yesterday. You might wonder why, and you also might wonder where the highlight video is. Um, and this is kind of an interesting story, so you might want to stay tuned for this. If you're going to go on a vacation, which I'm doing right now, as you see in the hotel room here, um, it'd be nice to be in a hotel that gives you Wi-Fi. <laughs> we get here uh, Wednesday, and by Thursday, there is an area-wide Wi-Fi problem, in which is, we, we on a, we're on a high floor right now, I think we're on the, the sixth floor, and the Wi-Fi apparently is not, from the higher you get, the Wi-Fi is not working. In, in this section of, 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 of the state. So it is such... So, so for the last 36 hours, I haven't had much Wi-Fi. Um, that's why there was no video yesterday. And then I found out today that the only way that I'm able to get Wi-Fi is if I go down to like the lobby or the mezzanine, whatever it's called, and, and use it there. But I can't record, I can't do audio stuff like this, so I have to record it here. So yeah, I'm here in a hotel room with no Wi-Fi in the hotel room. That, that It has been hell for the last day and a half. And I've had to... Go down, I, I've spent the last day in, in, in the lobby, or whatever it is, it just, that's how I'm getting Wi-Fi. And it's, it's been, it's, it has not been ideal, but that's how I've gotten it done here. Um, so, if you're wondering where that video was yesterday, and yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm sorry guys that this is how the videos are going to be today, and tomorrow this is how we're going to do the recap videos. I know these aren't ideal, I'd like to get back to doing the highlight videos, but for now, this is what we're, what we're stuck with. Um, but... By Sunday or Monday, the Wi-Fi will be back. So, um, you know, I'll be back. We'll be back home, and everything will be settled there. So, uh, hope you guys get through this. Hope you guys understand it all. I thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you if you if you like what you see, I promise it gets better. If you don't like what you see, I understand. But if you like what you see, make sure you subscribe down below for more better content every single day. I'll be back tomorrow, breaking down the final game of the series between the Yankees and the Orioles. Take care, guys, and God bless.